an act of spiritual communion. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My Jesus, I believe that you are present in the most holy sacrament. I love you above all things, and I desire to receive you into my soul. Since I cannot at this moment receive you sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. I embrace you as if you were already there and unite myself wholly to you. Never permit me to be separated from you. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us start with the sign of the crosser and let's recite the rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us pray for the intention of the Holy Father, Pope Francis, for all the clergy and all the priests in our parish, that the Lord bless them and keep them in the mystery. Let us pray for family and friends that the Lord in his finished mercy will give them peace in mind and spirit. And we pray for all the sufferers with COVID-19 that the healing hand of the Lord in his mercy will restore them into health. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the Holy Spirit born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, was buried. He descended into hell. On the third day, he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there, he will come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and life everlasting. Amen. We offer this, our Father, for the <clears throat> to honor the Father. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. And we offer this free Hail Mary for increase of faith, hope, and love. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. And Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. And we offer this of glory be to honor the Holy Trinity. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. In the first sorrowful mystery, we contemplate the agony in the garden. 
It is our which he paid with all the greatest intensity, and his sweet sweat became like drops of blood falling on the ground. Then he rose from prayer and came to the disciples, all to find them asleep, exhausted with grief. Let us pray for true completion for sin. Our Father, who art in heaven, allow be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead those souls into heaven, especially those who are most in need of their mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. In the second sorrowful mystery, we contemplate the soldiers, the soldiers of Jesus at the pillar. Pilate next move was to take Jesus and have him spirit. Let us pray for the virtues of purity. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail 
and Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O oh, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven, especially those who are most in need of their mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. On the third song from mystery, we contemplate the calm of his soul. They sweep him off of his clothes and wrap him in a scarlet military cloth, waving a crown out of thorns. They fix it on his head and struck a, a, a reed in his right hand. Let us pray for moral courage. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. The kingdom come that will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Amen. 
and Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. And Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O oh, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, especially those who are most in need of their mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria. On the fourth song from the same, we contemplate the carrying of the cross. Carrying the cross by himself, he went out to what is called the place of the skull in Hebrew, Golgotha. Let us pray for the virtues of patience. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O oh, glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit.
Oh my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, and lead all souls into heaven, especially those who are most in need of the mercy. Ave, Ave, Ave Maria, Ave. On the fifth episode of misery, we contemplate the crucifixion. Jesus uttered a loud cry and said, Father, into your hand I command my spirit. After he said this, he expired. Let us pray for final perseverance. Our Father, who art in heaven, allow be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst the women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh, my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls into heaven, especially those who are most in need of their mercy. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of mercy. Hail, our life, our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry for vanished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sight, nor do we weep, but of tears. To the most gracious advocate, thy eyes and words towards us. And after this, our exile, show to us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O Clement, O Lovely. O sweet Virgin Mary, as to beside the beat and of the blessed Virgin Mary, Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, have mercy on us. Lord, have mercy on us. Christ, hear us.
Christ the gracious is here. God the Father of heaven, God the Son Redeemer of the world, God the Holy Spirit, Holy Trinity, one God, Holy Mary, Holy Mother of God, Holy Virgin of Virgin, Mother of Christ, Mother of the Church, Mother of Mercy, Mother of Divine Grace, Mother of Hope, Mother Most Pure, Mother Most Chaste, Mother Violet, Mother and the Pilot, Mother Most Amable, Mother Most Admirable, Mother of Good Counsel, Mother of our Creator, Mother of our Savior, Virgin Most Prudent, Virgin Most Venerable, Virgin Most Renowned, Virgin Most Powerful, Virgin Most Merciful, Virgin Most Faithful, Mirror of Justice, Seat of Wisdom, Cause of Our Joy, Spiritual Vessel, Vessel of Honor, Single Vessel of Devotion, Mystical Rose, Tower of David, Tower of Ivory, House of Gold, Heart of the Covenant, Gate of Heaven, Morning Star, Health of the Sick, Refuge of Sinners, Souls of Migrants, Comfort of the Afflicted, Hulk of the Christians, Queen of Angels, Queen of Patriots, Queen of Prophets, Queen of Apostles, Queen of Martyrs, Queen of Confessors, Queen of Virgins, Queen of all saints, Queen conceived without origin of sin, Queen assumed into heaven, Queen of the Most Holy Rosary, Queen of Family, Queen of Peace, Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, spare us, O Lord. Lamb of God who takes away the sins of the world, graciously hear us, O Lord. Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, mercy on us. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. Let us pray. Grant we beseech you, O Lord God, that we, your servants, may enjoy the last help of mind and body and by the glorious intersection of the Blessed Virgin Mary. We ever deliver from present sorrow and enter into the joy of eternal happiness through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, and the love of God, and the peace and communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to our celebration of the Eucharist. Mass is being offered today for the repose of the souls of Dominic Meda and Manuel Angelo Viva Barbosa. As we prepare to celebrate this sacred mystery, let us call to mind our sins. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done and in what I have failed to do. Through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault, therefore I ask, Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, 
and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. Draw near to your servants, O Lord, and answer their prayers with unceasing kindness, that for those who glory in you as their creator and guide, you may restore what you have created and keep safe what you have restored. We ask this through Christ our Lord. A reading from the book of Genesis. In the beginning, when God created the heavens and the earth, God said, Let the waters bring forth swarms of living creatures, and let birds fly above the earth across the dome of the sky. So God created the great sea monsters and every living creature that moves of every kind, with which the waters swarm and every winged bird of every kind. And God saw that it was good. God blessed them, saying, Be fruitful and multiply, and fill the waters in the sea, and let the birds multiply on the earth. And there was evening, and there was morning, the fifth day. And God said, Let the earth bring forth living creatures of every kind, cattle and creeping things, and wild animals of the earth of every kind. And it was so. God made the wild animals of the earth of every kind, and the cattle of every kind, and everything that creeps upon the ground of every kind. And God saw that it was good. Then God said, Let us make human beings in our image, according to our likeness. And let them have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the birds of the air, and over the cattle, and over all the wild animals of the earth, and over every creeping thing that creeps upon the earth. So God created human beings in his image. In the image of God he created them. Male and female, he created them. God blessed them, and God said to them, Be fruitful and multiply and fill the earth, and subdue it, and have dominion over the fish of the sea, and over the birds of the air, and over every living thing that moves upon the earth. God said, See, I have given you every plant yielding seed, that is upon the face of all the earth, and every tree with the seed in its fruit. You shall have them for food. And to every beast of the earth, and to every bird of the air, and to everything that creeps on the earth, everything that has the breath of life, I have given every green plant for food, and it was so. God saw everything that he had made, and indeed it was very good. And there was evening, and there was morning, the sixth day. Thus the heavens and earth were finished, and all, the, all their multitude. And on the seventh day, God finished the work that he had done. And he rested on the seventh day from all the work that he had done. So God blessed the seventh day and hallowed it. Because of it, God rested from all the work that he had done in creation. These are the generations of heaven and earth when they were created. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Your response will be, Our Lord, our God. How wonderful your name in all the earth. O Lord our God, how wonderful your name in all the earth. When I look at your heavens, the work of your fingers, the moon and the stars that you have established, what are human beings that you are mindful of them, mortals that you care for them? O Lord our God, how wonderful your name in all the earth. Yet you have made them a little lower than God and crown them with glory and honor. 
You have given them dominion over the works of your hands. You have put all things under their feet. O Lord, our God, how wonderful your name in all the earth. All sheep and oxen, and also the beasts of the field, the birds of the air, and the fish of the sea, whatever passes along the paths of the sea. O Lord, our God, how wonderful your name in all the earth. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Turn my heart to do your will. Teach me your law, O God. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. When the Pharisees and some of the scribes who had come from Jerusalem gathered around Jesus, they noticed that some of his disciples were eating with defiled hands, that is, without washing them. For the scribes and Pharisees and all the Jews do not eat unless they thoroughly wash their hands, thus observing the tradition of the elders. And when they come from the marketplace, they do not eat unless they purify themselves. And there are also many other traditions that they observe, the washing of cups, pots, and bronze kettles. So the Pharisees and the scribes asked Jesus, Why do your disciples not live according to the tradition of the elders? but eat with the defiled hands. Jesus said to them, Isaiah prophesied rightly about you hypocrites, as it is written, This people honors me with their lips, but their hearts are far from me. In vain do they worship me, teaching human precepts as doctrines. You abandon the commandment of God and hold to the human tradition. Then Jesus said to them, You have a fine way of rejecting the commandment of God in order to keep your tradition. For Moses said, Honor your father and your mother, and whoever speaks ill of father or mother must surely die. But you say that if anyone tells father or mother, whatever support you might have had from me is korban, that is an offering to God, then you no longer permit doing anything for a father or mother, thus making void the word of God through your tradition that you have handed down. And you do many things like this, the gospel of the Lord. My dear friends, as we slowly begin to see a little light at the end of the tunnel, it appears as though the, the second wave of the COVID is, um, is coming to an end. At one time, it seemed as though it will continue indefinitely. Um, we have to start, you know, planning towards church. And it's interesting that um, our reading here focuses on church, on focuses on, um, on tradition. Um, and um, Jesus here condemns some of the traditions of the Jewish religious authorities, where he said that very often they pick the traditions that they liked, the easy ones, washing your hands before you eat, but the ones that were more difficult, like, for instance, supporting your father or mother, are the ones that they neglected. So we have to look more carefully at, you know, our own church and our own traditions, do we do the same thing? Do we pick on the things that are very easy to follow, but the ones that are more difficult are the ones that we tend to neglect or ignore completely? Um, you know, there is a, a phenomenon in the church called shopping cart Catholics. You know, we take off the shelf what we like and what we don't like, we just simply ignore. So that is a um, warning for us today as we think about the teachings of the Catholic Church, some of the teachings of the Catholic Church are pretty difficult to follow, um, but yet still they are, they are teachings that have been passed on to us through our own tradition. So let us pay attention to that today as we go about our various duties. Please stand as we pray. 
We thank God for yet another day. We thank Him for the gift of life, and we pray for every blessing upon us and upon our family. We pray to the Lord. We thank God for the church and all its traditions. We pray as Catholics we may be more sensitive even to the traditions that are difficult to follow. We pray to the Lord. For the sick, including those in our book of our sick book, that God may grant them healing. We pray to the Lord. As we continue to prepare for the season of Lent, as Wednesday is next week. We ask God to prepare our hearts that this Lenten season may be a time of spiritual renewal for all of us. We pray to the Lord. Almighty God, we place these prayers and intentions in your hands with faith and confidence in you. Come to us and assist us always in our need. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have this bread to offer, which earth has given and human hands have made. May it become for us the bread of life. Lord, by the mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, who humbled himself to share in our humanity. Blessed are you, Lord God of all creation, for through your goodness we have this wine to offer, fruit of the divine, and work of human hands may become for us our spiritual drink. Lord, wash away my iniquities and cleanse me of all my sins. Pray, brothers and sisters, that my sacrifice and yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. Graciously sanctify these gifts, O Lord, we pray, and accepting the oblation of this spiritual sacrifice, make of us an eternal offering to you. We ask this through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. Lift up your heart. Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is truly right and just, our duty and our salvation, always and everywhere to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For just as through your beloved Son you created the human race, so also through him with great goodness you formed it anew, and so it is right that all your creatures serve you, all the redeemed praise you, and all your saints with one heart bless you. Therefore, we too extol you with all the angels, as in joyful celebration we acclaim. Holy, holy, holy Lord, God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. You are indeed holy, O Lord, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the Jewful, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time he was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and, giving thanks, broke it, 
and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and eat of it, for this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice and once more, giving thanks. He gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and profess your resurrection until you come again. Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of his death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ we may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity, together with Francis, our Pope, Thomas, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with the Blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours, forever and ever. Amen. Jesus told us to call God our Father, and so we have the courage to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy, we may be always free from sin and safe from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Let us share with each other a sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. Lord, I am not worthy that you should enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Let us pray. Our company with constant protection, O Lord, the, those who renew with these heavenly gifts, and in your never-failing care for them, make them worthy of eternal redemption. We ask this through Christ our Lord. The Lord be with you. May Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Go forth, the Mass is ended.